What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Moon walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we kind of deviated from, you know, the, the mission, and now it is time for us to go into the next, uh, the next trial right here, because, well, you know, we've been putting it off for, like, the last two episodes. Now, we also got ourselves new Pokemon, a bunch of new stuff, very proud of it. Our team is coming together. I think I know exactly what's going to happen towards the end of this whole thing. So, here we are in Lush Jungle, and would you look at that? Mm, 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 mm. Malo is here, and she's like, thanks for stopping by. Welcome to Lush Jungle, the trial grounds for me, Malo. I knew, I knew it from the, I knew it the first time I saw you and your team. You've chosen only the finest ingredients. That's why I'm going to make you help me, or no. I mean, that's why I'm going to, uh, that's why you should uh, try my trial. You are the one who got the sparkling stone straight to Tapu Koko, aren't you? You're so totally ready for this. Ah, this breath of the uh, jungle. I can tell uh, I can tell just uh, what today's special should be. Now well, she cooks, huh? Yep, it's going to be my personal specialty, the Molo special. I'm going to need your uh, need you to find uh, four ingredients for me. I need a Mago Berry, a Tiny Mushroom, a Revival Herb, and a Miracle Seed. Here you go! I brought you a Forage Bag to hold all the ingredients gathered for you, uh, your trial. Oh. Okay, we're gonna be foraging. Oh. You guys already know that foraging's a thing, right? It's kinda weird, but it's still a thing. If you put the trial ingredients in your own bag, they'd get mixed up uh, with your stuff, right? When you're hunting for ingredients, you're gonna want to rely on Stoutland's help. It, it'll find things you don't see after all. You remember uh, you remember what I told you at the farm, right? Just press B to use Stoutland's search. Okay, one more time. There are four things you need to get for me to clear your trial. A Mago Berry, a Tiny Mushroom, a Revival Herb, and a Miracle Seed. You got that? Okay. Okay, then here in the Lush Jungle, it's time for the Malo's trial to begin. Okay, so here it is. It's time for the trial. Now... I think by already like by by this point right here, you guys would probably you probably would already have uh, all the ingredients, but she needs the ingredients from this place right here. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna be getting on Stoutland from Scotland. That's right, our good old buddy Stoutland from Scotland. He's gonna be looking for some stuff right here, sniffing out everything, not the butt cheeks of anybody else. But here we go, Stoutland from Scotland, ready to go. And it is getting something. It's getting a scent right here. Nope, lost the scent. Where is it? Come on, Stoutland. Stoutland from Scotland. Looking for something right here. Where the heck are you? Okay. Okay, so what if we go right here? It's right here. Where is it, boy? Right here, okay. And yes, we need a tiny mushroom. Okay, tiny mushroom for the forage bag. And a big mushroom attacked. Oh, crud baskets. Oh. And, well, here we go. Getting attacked by a Shinotic. Kind of sounds mystical and stuff. I don't know if you can capture these Pokemon right here. You still have to battle them, though. All right. Maximum effort. Ice Beam attack for the win. Mm-hmm. Ice Beam for the win. And uh, it looks like to me... Yes, that is a uh, that is awesome right there. Okay, so Drago grows to level 14, and well, we're gonna have to be moving on right here because I kind of feel like there's something else. Hey, it's me, Malo. Oh, a tiny mushroom. That's great. There's a secret to why they are so popular with some people. You'll have to try to find out what it is. Still, three ingredients are left to get. We still need a whole big helping. Okay, so. Let us move on right here. Uh, there's some grass that we can actually cross, but we are gonna have to wait on that. Let's go straight to this area right here, cause there, 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 there might be something right here. And look at that, Scotland from Scotland is already smelling something. And uh, well, it's probably right here. Ah, here we are. There we go. We got we grabbed ourselves a, a uh, well, a X special t attack. And huh? The heck? And we're getting attacked. Stoutland from Scotland. Already seen this one. 
And we're getting attacked by a Formatus. Oh, damn. Formatus. Okay, alrighty, here we go. Let's go with an Ice Beam attack. You know, it's pretty pretty cool that, you know, we, we, we trained or we gave some of these attacks to the Pokemon right here. And there goes a Fomantis. And all my Pokemon are growing levels. Alright, let's see. Now Sniff. Let's go Stutland from Scotland. And there is a Berry. And we found ourselves the Mago Berry. Hey, it's me, Malo. Congrats on finding the Mago Berry. The bigger the, and more twisted a Mago Berry, the sweeter it will taste. Still two more ingredients left to get, just a little more to find. Eh, well, you know, I can always come around here and... Yep, there's nothing else right here. Okay, so let's go right ahead and try and get to that item right there. So let's get the heck out of here. And let's move right here. And let's see, there might be something right around here. Okay, so there we go. Ah, here we go. Stoutland from Scotland has found the X defense. Should probably like, you know, probably telling of what, what, what we may cover and stuff. So let's go straight up right here. And oh, let's see. Oh, he's sniffing up something. Where is it? There we go, boy. It's right here somewhere. There we go. We found ourselves a hyper potion. Okay, and well, let's see. I think there's nothing right here. So let's go right ahead and sniff out something else. Oh, it's in here somewhere. There we go. Found it. We found ourselves a heal powder. And there might be something close by right here. It's right here somewhere. Where are you? Where are you, SOB? Ah, here we go. And a suspicious looking grass. Will you pull it up? Yes. We found ourselves a revival herb. And yes, we will be getting attacked by a Pokemon. You know, it's a must. We, we, we have to get attacked by a Pokemon. And... Well, there's another Fomantis right there. So let's go just... Uh, you know what? I kind of want to capture this Pokemon. I really do. I wonder if we can. Let's see. Let's go straight for a Disarming Voice. Fomantis is a pretty good Pokemon to actually have on your team if you... You know, if you didn't get yourself a Grass-type Pokemon. It's a pure grass type, and whoa, that really hit us hard. Let's go. Let's see, bag. Let's go with the great ball. Yeah, we can't catch any of these Pokemon right here. Okay, never mind. You saved yourself this time. Next time, I won't be so nice. So here we go, Ice Beam attack. And the Ice Beam hits it where it hurts. Yes, Fomantis defeated. Okay, alrighty. Feeling pretty good about that, right? Yes, we are. Okay, so there's nothing right here. And uh, hey, it's me, Molo, the fine uh, revival herb. It's better to, uh, bite is even a shock to Pokemon, but what? That's what it will add in to the flavor. Just one last ingredient left. Get back out there and fight it. Okay, whatever you say. Whatever you say. All right. So there is an entrance area right here that will allow us to. Oh, hold on. Yes, we can uh, go right here, and yes, look at that. We grabbed ourselves a TM-86 Grass Knot. A very interesting move. It's all weight-based, basically. And uh, let's see. I think I've already gotten the Revival Herb, so we need to get the heck out of here. And I do not feel like getting attacked by any of these Pokemon, so let's go ahead and use a Revive. And let's move on. Not getting attacked by a Pokemon. It's always great. Uh, let's see. There could be something right here, right? Hmm. No. There's nothing. Nothing right here. And feels soft to the touch. Oh, yeah. That's where you can actually uh, evolve one of your Pokemon. Uh, an Eevee, I should say. And, well, let's see. We got one more ingredient left. And that is not there. So let's go straight right here. And to me... Let's see. To me, it looks like... Yeah, we have to go right here, and let's not use a repel. Let's see what we can find right here. And let's see. Uh, Malo's special tip, when Pokemon Berry sees in the ground, they gain an especially rich and complex flavor. Okay. So let's see. Ah, here we go. Tauros. 
There we go. I love doing that. I really do. Okay. So let's go with Stoutland from Scotland. And is it sniffing anything? I don't know. Oh, look at this. It's finding something right around. Okay. Tauros, need your help. Destroy. There we go. I love doing that. Really do. Okay. And where, oh, where, oh, where could this thing be? Okay, it's not here. It's right here. All right, Taros, do it. Finish it. There we go. And back to Stoutland from Scotland. There we go. And yes, we found ourselves the Miracle Seed. And from there, Malo's going to be like, hey, it's me, Malo. That's a great Miracle Seed. Miracle Seeds are bursting with nutrition, and they really are a miraculous gift from uh, the jungle. Oh, it looks like you got everything. Okay. It's time f uh, for us to start cooking, so come on back into the entrance of the jungle. Okay, so we've completed that. Now, you guys may have noticed that there are um, big old bricks around here. That right... Th uh, yeah, we can't go there just yet because... Uh, what was it? Uh, yeah, we don't have the specific Pokemon for that little situation. And, well, we're going to go through here. And... It's going to be sniffing the butt crack of something. Nothing. Okay, right here. Found ourselves a big root. And... Nope, nothing right here. So here we are back, and there's our girlfriend, Malo. Hey, Draven! Great. Now that we've got all the ingredients we need... Sorry to keep you waiting. How are you, Malo? Oh, would you look at that. It's the last two totem, uh... People that we defeated. Kawaii, he, he's like, I brought a thick club and a rare bone. And I brought you, uh, and I brought you some fresh water and that usual rocky helmet. Thanks, Lana. Thanks, Kawaii. Now we've got everything we need. You're up next, Draven. We're going to cook up a storm and lure out the totem Pokemon in the jungle. Okay, let's see what we got. The one Mago Berry, one Tiny Berry, or Tiny Mushroom, one Revival Herb, a miracle seed and just what we need from everything else and the aroma of the tasting uh, dish will draw that totem Pokemon right to us ready to start cooking sure alrighty here we go okay Lana flip that rocky helmet over and let's pour that fresh water into it here you are and then go to the Mugberry and the Tiny Mushroom and the Revival Herb and the Miracle Seed. Kawhi, let us use the Thick Club and that Rare Bone for just the last minute. Here you are. Okay, Draven, grab the Thick Club and the Rare Bone and pound it all into a pulp. Okay, I'm going to... Look at that. Look at that, I'm doing that. Oh, yeah. Crush it! Look at that, I'm just balancing out. Oh, yes. There we go. Grind it! There we go. And what else? Turn it to go. To, to goo, I should say. She's enjoying everything. And then a unique aroma begins to waft around the area. And you fear a piercing glaze from somewhere within the underbrush. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. She doesn't seem to be scared except... Oh, damn. Oh, my God. It's going to eat us. Run! Lorantis, the totem Pokemon of the lush jungle, has appeared. Okay. Alrighty, so here we go, guys. We're taking on uh, Totem Lorantis, or Lorantis, and. Well, it's turning Super Saiyan right here, so its speed has risen. We're gonna be going with Inferno Blade right here. And. Well, we got the advantage right now. Let's go for a U turn, mainly because this guy can switch out now I could be wrong this is a bug type Pokemon too nope it is super effective and we have drawn Inf uh, Inferno Blade back so let's go with dump truck right here because it does have a poison jab attack and of course going to be calling its ally Pokemon now its ally Pokemon right here is a cast form and cast form of We'll be using it. We'll be using a, one of its weather attacks just to power up Lorantis and I crap baskets. I couldn't. I uh, should have uh, gotten with Lorantis right here. And well, here comes a synthesis attack. This Pokemon is yes going to be healing itself. And since we're in a jungle, yeah, look at that. Okay, so now we're in trouble. We are in deep, deep trouble right here. And well, Cast Forms forecast. 
will actually transform it right here. So here goes a poison jab to the wrong Pokemon. This one will nearly take it, and there's a poison touch. So right now, we do have a bit of an advantage. Love that the that poison touch will actually hurt this Pokemon. So let's go right ahead and use another uh, poison jab to the right Pokemon this time. And hopefully we can actually poison this guy right here. All right, Lorantis using Solar Beam, I think. Yep, using Solar Beam. Holy crap. Bam! And that is not super effective. And here comes a headbutt attack. So we've given it everything. And yes, you're going to get poisoned. Eat it, cast form. All right, here we go. Go for another poison jab right here. And yes, this Pokemon is not going to let us attack it. Probably should have given it like a quick claw. And here comes a... So oh, it's a solar blade. Hmm, Okay. Kind of like Solar Beam, except it's Solar Blade, and here comes a Headbutt attack. Yeah, this Pokemon is not going to let us attack it, but here goes a Poison Jab attack. Super Poisonous, and that's right, Cast Form. You're no more. Okay, alrighty. So none of that, and Terra Ruff grows a level 20, Drago to level 15, and here comes another ally Pokemon, and I wonder what that Pokemon could be. And it is a uh, Trumbeak. Okay, so we're in a little bit of trouble right here. And, well, let's go with the Rock Slide, just so we can take care of Trumbeak right here. And just like that, here comes a Synthesis Attack. This will actually regain all its HP since it's a sunny day. And, well, Trumbeak with a Peck Attack, not so effective. God dang it! Okay, so... You got the best of me on that one. Let's go straight to Inferno Blade. Okay, now this is going to be this is going to be interesting right here. So let's go with a flame charge so I, we can actually increase our speed just a tad bit more. Let's go Inferno Blade. You are crap baskets. X scissors going to hit us. And since it is a sunny day, this will power us up just a bit more. Look at that. Ooh. And yes, now who the fast Pokemon is, and crap! I hate Trumbeak, I really do. I really do hate it, and the sun has faded. Okay, so let's go right ahead and use a Flame Charge. Hopefully we are faster than Lurantis. And come on, come on. Damn it, come on. Yes, Flame Charge for the win. That's right. Lorantis has been defeated and this will increase its level to level 32 okay alrighty and Trumbeak is now being a dick throwing a rock blast now this is a good Pokemon to actually have and wow okay you're gonna pay for this you're gonna pay for that you really are okay so let's see we're gonna be switching out our Pokemon right here I'm going to invoke my full power onto this Pokemon right here. Let's switch it up to Puka. And Puka, you know what to do. Destroy it. And here comes a Rock Blast attack. Not super effective. It's going to take 5 HP every single time. And that right there. Wow. What are the odds it's going to hit me 5 friggin' times? Okay. Time to die. Here we go. Wild Charge for the win. Oh, yes. Suck it, Trumbeak. In fact, that's probably the real freaking uh, totem Pokemon right there. And just like that, we defeat everybody. And Drago grows a level 16. Look at that, Puka. Puka's, uh, you know, surfing. Surfing on good waters right there. What now? And, well... Molo's like, wow, Draven, you're strong, huh? You... You were really able to draw out the flavor of your Pokemon in that battle. That totem Pokemon bowed right down to you. Yes, even back in at Well of uh, Volcano Park, my vaunted Salazzle didn't stand a chance. <laughs> Nor did Wishy Washy uh, that I had trained so carefully. All right, you've cleared all three of Call of Trials. You even managed to get through my trial, and I'd say a real doozy. 
here a gift of such an inspiring Pokemon and just like that guys we get ourselves our next badge I mean you know crystal since you know they don't believe in badges here alrighty so here it is guys BAM we completed the trial the three trials in the Kala and well time for her to show me the pose of the ancient Pokemon all right Sh let me show you uh, how to use the grass type Z moves you go like grass K okay? okay there we go grass all right all right okay since you cleared my trial Draven I want you to help me train some Pokemon from here in the lush jungle here have some nest balls Alrighty, we got ourselves a ten of these little bastards. Hmm, it looks like Lorantis didn't finish all its food. Oh, I really want you guys to try some. Have a bite, Kawaii. You too, Lana. If you insist. Alrighty, okay. The flavor from the rare bones seemed to fill my, my whole mouth. It tastes so good you might you might melt. No, wait, is that my tongue that's melting? Oh, wow. Um, it's, it, it's so, uh-oh, it's spicy! Uh-oh. What, what, what's wrong with you guys? You didn't have a, you don't have any taste? Are you headed off to Olivia's for the grand trial? Okay. All right. And just like that, Kakui's like, whoo, that was that sweet smell, uh, or what's that sweet smell I've been uh, drifting on my way? Could it be a tasty mala special? I heard you clear the Mala's trial, yeah? Alright then, I have a present for you. A little TM, there is Smart Strike, a move that will never miss. And there it is, guys. We got ourselves a TM67 Smart Strike. There will be all kinds of discoveries and new experiences to make your adventure brighter. There's a facility, yeah, that I want you to go and check out on your island challenge. The Dimensional Research Lab. Let's go over with, a, with extreme speed, wow. Alrighty. Okay, so we're moving on right here. And hey there, Draven. I guess I should congratulate you on clearing all three of Akala's uh, island trials. Congrats. Looks like it's time for you to take on a Kahuna Olivia's grand trial. Olivia's an expert user of rock type Pokemon. You're going to uh, want to catch some grass type Pokemon uh, in Lush Jungle to add to your team. Whenever you're ready for the grand trial, Come see me at the Dimensional Research Lab. It's down past Route 6, yeah, but just ask Rotom if you need some help. Okay, so there we go with another trial taken care of. And it looks like to me we need to finish the big, big one. The big one, you know, the big trial and all that stuff. So let's go right ahead and uh, let's see. I guess we have to take a look at our Pokey, our passport or something like that. So there we go, started from the bottom, now we're here, and uh, well, I think, uh, yeah, we still need to, we still need to feed, uh, finish the whole trial right here, so in the next episode, guys, we're going to be going straight to Route 6 to go and uh, complete this whole thing right here. Stay tuned, more great things will happen right here on our Pokemon Moon Walkthrough. See you guys.